What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Spiritual Zen, man, and I'm back with another video, man. How you guys doing? I hope you guys are taking care of yourself as always, man. Let me let this car pass real quick. I just got back from the gym, man. You know what I mean? That's what I've been doing, man. I just I started going to the gym now. You know what I mean? Being focused on myself, trying to improve myself. You know what I mean? Because, you know, like, going to the gym not only improves your mindset, bro. It improves your body. It makes you stronger. You know, it, it makes you manifest better. You know what I mean? When you're in the gym, you're not only training your body, you're training your mind, bro. And since I've been in the gym, I've been improving a lot mentally, you know what I mean? And physically, but mentally for the most part. You know, it made me more disciplined. It made me more patient, you know what I mean? It made me more stronger, you know? And it gave me more energy to actually do something, you know? It makes me more more active it makes me more consistent it makes me less lazy because you know like being comfortable makes you lazy bro and a lot of people are scared to go to the gym because it makes them feel uncomfortable bro it's hard you have to you have to lift weights you gotta do sit-ups you gotta do all that and don't nobody want to do that but you gotta be disciplined for you to be able to go to the gym every single day you know what i mean it's a good day you know what I mean? Like, it's, the sun is shining. You know, it's not, not not a lot of weird stuff is going on. That's what I like, bro. You know what I mean? That's what I like about the, the earth. You know, you just get to, you get to breathe in that good ass prana, head ass. I'm just playing, man. <laughs> I'm just playing, man. But, uh, yeah, uh, ah. Uh, I know y'all clicked on this video for the title, man. You know what I mean? It's a lot of shit I want to talk about, man. I know you guys haven't heard my voice in a minute. I hope you guys are doing good as always. You know what I mean? I hope you guys is literally working on yourselves for real, for real. But with all that put to the side, man, my bad if it's windy, bro. You know what I mean? I'm walking right now. So it's a lot of cars passing, so it's going to be a, a little too windy. But it's whatever, man. It's all about being authentic. I like videos that are raw. I don't like forcing stuff. I don't like coming. I don't like coming to a video, you know, with a fake persona. I, I like doing my shit raw. That's why I can't upload videos every single day for you guys. Cause you know, every time I do videos, I do videos based on energy, bro. I don't do videos just to do videos you know what i mean i don't do it for the clout i don't do it for nothing bro like i said in the beginning of my channel i'm doing this channel as like a diary you know what i mean it's like a diary for myself i'm not doing it for anyone else i'm doing it for myself you know what i mean you know like ralph smart before i get straight to the point of the video ralph smart i'll say it all the time on my videos bro he i have no problem with ralph smart i have no beef with him i have nothing against him I am just pre preaching the truth, you know what I mean? I am just saying things that I see and that a lot of people DM me explaining about him, you know what I mean? These are not cap, you know what I mean? This is not cap. Why would I cap, bro, on, on shit that is literally on the internet? All you gotta do is look it up. All you gotta do is look it up, bro. That's all you gotta do. And it's really not that hard to look a lot of things up. It's just that a lot of people can't think for themselves. They just, you know what I mean? They just, uh, uh, a sheep, you know what I mean? A bot, follow everybody. You just don't want to think for yourself. That's why you always be in a low vibrational state because you can't think for yourself, you know? And I know a lot of people know me for Ralph because that's, that's literally who uh, introduced you guys to me. But it's like... A lot of you guys, a lot of you guys don't know how to think for yourself, bro. You really don't know how to think for yourself. You just based your opinion off of what someone else tells you. You just don't have your own mind. You don't have a mind of your own. You know what I mean? And a lot of those people really like, I don't like, I don't like entertaining people like that. Because at the end of the day, you know, it's, 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 it's like, I can't, I can't force you to be what you don't want to be. I can't force you to change your ways i can't force you to focus on yourself i can't get force you to meditate it's all up to you you know what i mean but to get that out the way man uh 
you know i don't like really speaking on ralph a lot on my videos because you know it brings in a lot of it brings in a lot of negative energy to my channel which i don't like you know what i mean i don't like a lot of negative energy on my channel but you know usually i do these videos because really i don't give a fuck and i do it for y'all the ones that want answers and stuff like that so um to get back to the title you know uh one of my subscribers sent me uh 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 this video back you know what i mean screenshots basically of this song that i'm about to explain to you guys you know what i mean he sent me screenshots explaining the song saying that yo you got you need to check this out because i think he's seen one of my videos where i exposed ralph you know what i mean and basically on that video where i exposed him i was talking about how he was manipulating that female on that video hold on because on that video you can blatantly see like i even posted screenshot messages against him and the girl he was trying to manipulate the girl at, th at that point i didn't really understand what's going on i was just speaking against what i was told by the female you know what i mean and i did my own research too but you know what i mean i had like a like an hour conversation with this female i couldn't record it because she didn't want me to record it so like out of her uh privacy i couldn't record it uh so basically i dropped that video of me exposing ralph called ralph smart exposed make sure you go check that video out to actually understand where i'm going with this video uh man that's a g-wagon bro i need a g-wagon man that's my dream car but uh right after i dropped that video bro a lot of people been dming me bro telling me yo a lot of females been DMing me, telling me, yo, even um, niggas telling me like, yo, I went through the same problems, the same similarities and all that shit. So if it's like over hundreds of people that went through the same thing as this female, how am I wrong? How am I cow chasing? You know what I mean? But today I'm about to explain it a little more deeper because now I understand why he did what he did. I understand why Ralph does what he does now. You know what I mean? After doing this research i understood him better now <sighs> let me get my phone out bro let me get my phone out for this one man you know what i mean i don't like you know i don't like just talking i need to come with the facts because a lot of people think that like everything i say is literally false and stuff like that it's literally hold on man let me pull up these screenshots i'm gonna post them on the video so that you guys can uh so that you guys can read it and you can do your own research about it hold on let me look for these screenshots real quick okay uh this is the first screenshot right i need you to pause the video and read this screenshot the name of the song now this screenshot is on raw smart's page as you guys can see now this is the song that guy sent me. He said I should check this song out. You know what I mean? So I went to Ralph Smart's page. I went to his playlist. And this is literally the second, as you can see on the screenshot, it's the second song. And the name of the song is KRS-1 13 and Good. You know what I mean? That's the name of the song. I'm finna read comments. I'm, I'm finna read comments that explain the song better so you guys can understand what I'm trying to say. Then I'm gonna bring my own opinion into what uh, the song actually means. You feel me? Hold on. Now, this is the first comment, bro. Pause the video and read this comment. Uh, hold on. This is by Enlightened One. Now, what he said was Damn. First time I've heard this too. But when I think about way back when in the 80s, we did have a lot of fast ass young girls running around posing like they were older. We called them fast asses, jail bait, and so on. So yeah, you have to zoom back into the early 80s hip hop. KRS One didn't say that he was chasing young girls. He rapping about a young girl that lied about her age and he couldn't tell by her looks or even the coochie. You know what I mean? That was the first comment. This is the second comment. Pause the video and read this comment. If you listen at the beginning of the song, he uh, this is by Jonathan Kidd, my bad, y'all. If you listen at the beginning of the song, 
he assumed she was 26 and after they uh, had sex he asked her how old she was and th uh, that is when he found out she was 13 uh, also when he says the moral of the story is there is no moral as in society has no morals get it young underage girls at parties liquor stores sleeping with older men and living fast grown-ass men sleeping with young girls and men on the down low her dad etc all equals no morality is sad but it's more common than you think i believe that krs was just telling a story uh, about a situation that people don't like to shed light on and sweep under the rug it's truth but for those who are not lyricists or writers just take stuff on face value they would not understand the message now this is the last comment by uh i don't really Layson wills i can see how the song can easily be taken as him being an undercover pedophile if indeed he is not a pedophile he should have took himself out of that story and put an unknown person in it just in case people start looking at him the wrong way which now they are then there's another comment saying sick which is like he's they're in disgust about what they just heard now let me put that away to explain the song for those of y'all that don't know that krs one song is about underage females it's about pedophiles men who are pedophiles men who attack young girls underage young girls you know what i mean underage young girls not any type of females females that are younger than them like years younger than them it could be a decade it could be 15 years whatever bro it's more comments you guys can go check it on the page it's more comments explaining the song into deeper detail but when i when i saw the when i heard the song everything clicked bro because you know i had to meditate on this bro that's why it took this long for me to drop a video like this i had to think like yo why why was someone so positive like ralph smart right a guy dad has this positive persona like listening to songs that are this crazy like an average human being like an old man what are you doing listening to a song about pedophiles and why is it on your playlist when a song is on your playlist bro that means that you listen to the song regularly that's what it means it, you listen to the song regularly so this made me realize like damn he wasn't really manipulating these girls after all that was not really what he was doing Ralph Smart is actually a pedophile bro he is an actual pedophile if you look at his videos bro the only thing that he that you see on his page other than himself are girls it could be that other girl what's her name again what's her name bro damn how could, how could I forget her name bro that other spiritual youtuber female i don't really watch her videos but i'm sure a lot of you guys know her in all his videos i think it'll pop up but uh in all his videos he got that female and he only got females on his video bro he only got females and it's females that are modeling his merch you do not see men you do not see niggas anywhere bro he's only chasing after the females and it's young females the female that hit me up on that exposed video, she was young, bro. She was young, and she was telling me how he he traumatized her, bro. And how he did a lot of crazy shit trying to put her in a cult. You know what I mean? But this man is actually a pedophile. I think he's trying to get with young women, bro. That's what, how I feel with this whole matter. Because think about it, bro. Which grown man goes around listening to songs like that? songs that embrace pedophilia that does not make sense bruh and for you to put it on your playlist that makes you look even crazier bro that makes you look even crazier bro but a lot of people gonna think i'm reaching bro you know what i mean a lot of his fans that don't know how to think for themselves they probably gonna think that i'm reaching but it's literally hundreds of girls females women that have dm me bruh telling me the same story bro you guys could even go look at the comments on all my videos it's a lot of females crying out against this uh uh guy you know what i mean like from the jump bro 
from the jump when i used to watch his videos for the first time i watched it regularly you know what i mean and i'll say that all the time but it was always this this little i don't know i felt a negative vibration bro you know because i'm deep on energy bro I, I can read people's energy and i felt this weird energy i felt this weird vibration like man why is this nigga always smiling why is this nigga it, it it doesn't it doesn't seem normal bro if someone comes to you like that like it's not it's not not that i'm saying it's wrong for you to be happy and smiling and everything but not on every on all your videos like i know for a fact bro i know for a fact none of his fans or followers or subscribers that watch his content have seen him mad have seen him in a in a serious state in a serious tone you know what i mean no one has ever seen this man serious no one has ever seen this man mad bro no one knows this man's background no one knows this man at all bro all we know is that it's this man that's preaching about all these uh uh fake news you know what i mean a man preaching about the same thing he's talking about the same thing in all his videos bro like there's no message he's he's he's, he's like the news you know what I mean? He's like the news channel. Like, everything he said, you already know it. You already know everything he says, bro. It's not it's not new to us. It's not new to nobody. Why don't you educate us about ourselves instead of the society that you are promoting? You know what I mean? This agenda that you are pr promoting. You know what I mean? Ralph Smart is the only spiritual YouTuber that I know that does not receive any copyright strikes, does not have no copyright guidelines nothing bro does not have youtube trying to blacklist his, his channel or uh 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 what's the word uh shadow ban his channel his channel is not shadow ban he's the only spiritual youtuber that's posting at his pace every single day a lot of us bro we be, we be getting copyrights back to back spiritual soul another example there he's real He's not smiling on videos. We can see his pain that he he uh, portrays when he, he talks about his video. But I don't really watch spiritual soul like that. But what I'm trying to say is like he got striked for, for for speaking against the government, speak about deep stuff about the coronavirus and all that stuff. He got strikes on his channel. He couldn't post for months. You know what I mean? That is who is preaching real information, bro. Not no Ralph Smart, bro. Ralph Smart, bro, like, I feel like it's, it's a lot of females, brainwashed females, they're watching, and a lot of kids, bro. Because old people, if you show Ralph Smart's content to an old person, an actual old person that, like, I'm not just talking about any old people, because there's some old people that are just, you know, like, if you're an old person, bro, if you're an old person and you don't know how to think for yourself and you're old, bro, you failed in life. Because it's like, that's, 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 I don't wanna, I don't wanna speak on that right now. But what I'm trying to say is like, bro, something, something is up with Ralph, bro. Something is up, and uh, I guess like it's gonna crumble. Like I said, bro, at some point, bro, his own people are gonna find out who he truly is, bro. Might not be now, might not be, I don't know when, but you know, by the time you'll find out, I'll be already like past it. You know what I mean? Like a lot of a lot of a lot of prophets, revolutionaries, their message is only heard once they pass or once they 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 I don't know man, once they go ghost. That's when people realize the message. They won't realize it now because you know they're all fooled by what they see on, on, on YouTube, what the persona, like the devil for example, says in the Bible, the devil can transform into many forms, bro. You know what I mean? The devil can transform into many forms and can fool you, bro. He was once a snake and fooled, I don't know if it was Adam or Eve, to eat the apple. So and the, the devil comes in different forms. And not everybody that looks like they got good intentions has good intentions, bro. Some people just want to put you in their cult. Some people just want to brainwash you. Some people want to sacrifice you, bro. Because it's real. This is real life, bro. The devil exists, man. And, and evil spirits exist, bro. All that negative energy exists. And in this world, we are all powered by 
uh, negative energy, not positive energy, negative energy. Positive energy is when you think for yourself. You know what I mean? And then when you can actually do stuff for yourself and like, you know what I mean? Meditate, sun gaze, whether it's hitting the gym, you will never see Ralph doing that though. You will never see him t preach about that though. You never see him do something like that though. You just gonna see him talk about irrelevant things. But you know, like I said in the beginning of this video, I don't like making videos about Ralph. I just wanted to speak on that. You know what I mean? This this will probably be one of the last videos I'm gonna drop on Ralph. You know what I mean? Bro, I can keep doing what he's doing, man. Whoever wants to be brainwashed by what he's doing, you know, I, uh, do you, man. I'm not gonna control you. I'm gonna just keep preaching my real. I'm going to keep preaching my truth and I'm going to try helping as many people as I can while I'm still here, man. And I'm not gone. I will uh, come back and drop uh, a lot of videos for you guys. You know what I mean? I was just, you know, busy, man. Building, you know, uh, working on myself, trying to improve, trying to get better. And yeah, man, without further ado, man, make sure you guys take care of yourself. Have a mind of your own. Think for yourself, most importantly. And I'm going to catch you guys on the next one, man. Spiritual Zen signing out. Peace, man.